Hi, welcome back to my channel. I'm Solari, I'm an esports caster. Today is the day when I have a cast in the evening. This actually is my third day of casting in a row, so I'm a little bit tired. But today is a very important day because today is small finals for Ultra Liga, the Polish league that I cast for. I'm gonna take you with me today to show you how exactly I get prepared for a cast. I have already done some video editing job that I needed to do, so what I'm going to focus on is my casting notes. This is the end of the split, so I know the teams already rather well, which means that I don't need any extensive notes for anybody or anything. In the case of a new leak, I will keep all my notes on my iPad just with me because I really like handwriting on this thing. What I want to familiarize myself with right now is the drafts of everybody. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go through the teams that are playing today. Today it's going to be back to the game uh, against Zero Tenacity. I'm going to go through the teams and I'm going to go through all of the picks and try to predict what is going to be happening in the draft. I also want to have a look at some drafts from two days ago when Zero Tenacity were playing against Orbit Anonymo because I feel like they did make some mistakes in their draft and I wonder if they had enough time to fix those and if they're going to fix them. So now it's 13.07, which means right now what is going to happen, I'm gonna get myself some coffee and have a little bit of uninterrupted work time. gonna be my call time soon so that would be the moment when I stop doing my prep and focus on preparing myself more physically to the cast. As I said already it is my third day in a row of casting so my throat does hurt me a little bit so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do a little bit of the inner leader session. Every time I post myself on Instagram doing this thing people write to me like oh no are you sick what happened I'm not sick this is literally the best thing for your throat. I use it whenever I feel a little bit tired from talking a lot. Uh, I like using it before the cast and it does help with my allergies a lot. So I highly recommend if you don't have this thing, get one. It is gonna look a little bit scary though, but well. I'm gonna do makeup right now. I'm gonna do something very lightweight. I am not a big fan of makeup per se. I'm pretty confident these days with how I look but the thing is I actually tried going on cast without makeup and I don't like the feeling of it that much. First of all the camera of course changes the face quite a bit but it's also I want I think my job as a caster is to bring in a show and I feel like the appearance also can play a bit in this show factor so I would rather have myself prepped plus it's kind of showing that you know I made an effort of looking good for the cast for the viewers so we're gonna do something very light right now whenever I have a live cast or a cast from the studio I'm going to do much more with my face. Like the makeup is going to be heavier because in the studios or on the LAN events, they use very different cameras and lights from what I have at home. They are stronger and they mute all the colors and all your facial features into one. Plus there is a lot of light, so it's really, um, it's really hot in the studios and you sweat a lot. Wait, I want it higher. For me, it's going to be a much heavier, more heat resistant and camera resistant makeup if I go cast from a studio. But today is still a cast from home, so I don't have to care too much. This is a torture device and it looks like one. Doing makes up like that doesn't take me much time whatsoever. It's like a couple of minutes and I'm ready to go. Uh, it's usually whenever I do cosplays or any elaborate looks, then yes, it can take up to several hours to get a full cosplay face on my face. 
but I'm so happy when I don't have to do it, obviously, because it's what, 10 minutes and I'm ready and I can go wherever. The greatest thing about casting from home is that I only need to change the upper part of my outfit and I can still wear my comfy pants. I don't need to do anything about that. <laughs>